from Graphic Extras. In this tutorial, I'm just going to quickly show you how to create a sort of swirly, sort of unusual woodcut etching kind of effect in Photoshop using CC and the oil paint. Now, just going to go using patterns, and the patterns are from Graphic Extras. And just going to go to a layer, new fill layer, pattern, click OK. I'm going to select that one. Just going to just there's various patterns here. They're from Graphic Extras. They're pattern designs. Uh, right, just going to go with that one. Just select one. Otherwise, I'll just keep going through all of them. So just flatten that. And the first step is oil paint. I love the oil paint filter. Really, one of the excellent filters that came along with uh, recent versions of Photoshop. And you can obviously tweak the shine all various other settings as well click OK right that's the initial start point now image adjustments threshold now this sort of puts it to a sort of etching woodcut kind of design just gonna go there at that point well actually at that point you of course could finish but I'm actually gonna now apply the oil paint again and this is the the next step as you just apply it once more, and you can actually see now that the actual lines are actually sort of flowing very quickly. Just there, click OK, and I'm going to apply it again, and apply it again, and I'm going to go now back. This is a couple of steps going through the threshold and oil paint, and just and you've actually got now quite chunky lines, which are a lot more like wood cut. So I'm just going to click OK and I'm going to go back again to the oil paint. And now, every time you apply it, you've actually got fairly smooth. And of course, you could also apply like a maybe a blur as well in, in between. So apply a few more oil paints. And you've now actually got the lines are actually really starting to uh, sort of swirl very nicely. And you can actually continue this approach and I'm just going to go to layer duplicate layer and I'm going to do a quick transform flip horizontal and I think it's quite a nice effect is actually just using the overlay you can actually apply various overlays you can create very sort of weird unusual sketchy effects using this lighten and that's started to create now quite ghostly like sketch lines sort of smears in the oil paint. I'm going to flatten that at this point and I'm going to go back now to the oil paint and the oil paint is becoming more and more very sort of ghostly like oil paint smears lines are getting thicker it's, well of course you can tweak the shine as well just apply it like that oil paint And so on and of course you can combine again with the good old image threshold again great it make even thicker darker lines go back to the oil paint and the lines actually are starting to look very unusual so all of them stretching and swirly Anyway, hope you found this quick guide to the oil paint and threshold I think combination of both of those filters as well as like say blur can be of quite useful of interest as well for creating some unusual designs using patterns as well as that much else always adding new videos so if you would like please subscribe to the graphic extras channel on YouTube that'd be really great and thank you much